Well, good morning, Holiday Hill family. Josh here in the youth room for Throwback Thursday. And today's Throwback Thursday takes us to the presidency of one Calvin Coolidge. Cool cow. He's a man of few words, actually, as a matter of fact. There was an anecdote about him once about how a woman said she made a bet that she could get Calvin Coolidge to say more than three words. Calvin Coolidge looked at her and said, you lost. <laughs> and that's just kind of the personality he was. He was a even keel kind of guy. And he was liked by many people, as a matter of fact. So liked, in fact, that one citizen from Mississippi decided to gift President Calvin Coolidge a raccoon for Thanksgiving. Because what Thanksgiving meal isn't is complete without a raccoon? So a raccoon is given to President Calvin Coolidge, and he and the family really don't know what to do with this. I mean, I guess they were supposed to kill it and eat it, or kill it and or stuff it, because, again, why not? It's Mississippi. I mean, what did you expect? And Calvin Coolidge pardoned the raccoon. And then the family decided to keep the raccoon as a pet. They named her Rebecca. She was the first raccoon. Kind of like I have the first lady. It was the first raccoon. And Rebecca lived in luxury and happiness in the White House for all of her days. So what do we get from this? Sometimes we may feel like we are not the best. Actually, we're less than best. We're less than even good. We may feel like a trash panda, essentially. But you know what? We have our Lord, we have our Creator, who says we're fearfully and wonderfully made. And that we're made with a purpose. And there are times maybe we don't deserve good things. But in His grace, He gives us good things. Be encouraged with that truth today. Sometimes we can be like the, we, we can be like the raccoon. And it feels like we don't fit. God loves you anyway. Take care and God bless.